Okay. As you guys know, things are getting really heated here in the world. We're entering uh, World War III and um, the Department of Defense asked me to find a faster and easiest way to send out uh, grenades for them. So, so that the troops won't have a hard time figuring all this out. It'll be all remote controlled. And I figured what's the easiest way to do this is use two RC cars to send out, uh, to send out our uh, grenades, okay? And uh, it's an M67 frag grenade, and then uh, we're gonna use these RC cars, just buddy. Okay. The four by four to uh, take out a bunker. We created a little cinder block, small version bunker. We're gonna see what kind of damage one of these uh, grenades can do, and uh, we'll go from there. Uh, I got tired just building that wall. <laughs> okay. What do we do, Jasperi? What's the first thing we're gonna do? I'll show you. This is what we wanna do, because this is really legit. So, we're gonna uh, put the grenade on the first car, and the second car is gonna follow it. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, operate the first car, going inside the bunker. Jasperito is gonna operate the second car with the string attached from the bumper of this one to the pin of the grenade. And, uh, as I'm going in, he's gonna stop and go reverse and pull the pin and then we should see a huge explosion over here. It's a five second grenade and it should take out the enemy. Any questions? Very uh, simple, right? Very simple, yeah. Theoretically, this is very simple. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that, that's, uh... <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Let me see. When I used to teach people how to uh, when I used to teach soldiers how to operate these grenades, the number one issue is people get scared and they don't throw the grenade. They pull the pin and they just hold on to it. That's a fun fact for you guys if you didn't know. Did you know that, Jasperi? Yes. I know that. I heard an explosion somewhere. Did you hear that? Yes, I hear something. I hear something. Huh? What was that? I don't know. Maybe this somebody do the same experiment. But <laughs> maybe. This maybe is the area. Uh, this is area 51. No, no, no. Maybe uh, the government. Uh, Tell a lot of people, hey, awesome. you can try this thing for me. <laughs> How we can? <laughs> Not only you, you believe you're the only one, right? Okay. Yeah. Let's show our um, bunker. Our bunker. Two cinder blocks up and down, made it a little bit deep. We're gonna put some wood on top to see what happens. This GoPro here will go in my pocket for now. I'm gonna duct tape this grenade to the blue truck and then pull the pin with the second truck. That's pretty ready? I'm ready. Okay, the grenade is in. We're gonna go from the... I'm gonna go like this and then one like this. This is really scientific. <laughs> okay, this is not a laughing matter. This is where you gotta be careful. Come on, wait, wait. If I, I have to drive to the same speed, right? I don't know. You're gonna have to just follow me, and then at one point when the car goes in, you go reverse, and this thing is gonna pull. Okay, but I have to drive really close to you. Like, like three, four feet. Okay. Is enough. Gavron, you better not pull the pin before because we ha I have to reach the bunker. I know, that's the thing. So be careful. I don't know if... Hey, don't pull too much, Gavron. No, wait, I know what I'm doing. Gavron, I'm expert. Okay. So you want to get it from this corner here. So the pin is on that grenade right there. Okay. And then we're gonna... This is the best way to do this. If you do not, uh, if you're scared to throw these grenades, like I said, that's the number one, that's the number one uh, failure 
when people pull the pins and they get scared to throw it they're usually worried they'll throw it really close or right over there so they don't they don't throw it they pull the pin and they sit there and you have to put the pin back in okay there's our setup there's our bunker i don't know what else to tell you guys that's it uh camera i got a tripod over there another gopro in my pocket we're gonna hide uh we're gonna hide behind these uh, walls for the explosion and we're gonna operate the rc whoa, whoa, cars whoa, whoa, whoa. it's not over <laughs> what do you mean we're gonna we're gonna write we're gonna drive the operate the rc cars from behind this wall okay the only problem is we are so far back you can't really see the bunker from from here i don't think you can see it. you can see a little bit of it you're gonna see the explosion but I want to put a couple of the cameras around just to catch that. The GoPro hopefully catches that too if it doesn't get destroyed. <laughs> if it doesn't get blown away. Oh, this thing is all crooked too. Wait. Ay, cabron, this guy is crazy. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. Okay, hopefully this works. Can you see where you're, where you're uh, driving? Is that thing still recording? Yeah. Okay, we're good. Okay, ready? Ready. Okay, guys, go one. I can see nothing. Okay, fire in the hole! Woo! Oh! <laughs> Oh my god, the camera that came all the way back here. Cabro! The car disappeared! The what? The car! The pickup! The oh my truck. god! <laughs> no freaking way! Oh my god! Okay, there was stuff flying on oh. my car for all the way. Oh wait, the, I think the car flew back! No way! I don't know, this was crazy. <laughs> There's nothing left from the bunker. It's gone. There's only this the first car left over there. Okay. Cabron, that's just it. That's it. <laughs> cabron, did you see stuff fly over our head? Yeah, cabron, a lot of things. Oh my god. Oh well there's nothing left from the bunker. <laughs> There is nothing left over here. <laughs> well, wait, wait, wait. The smell. The it's, pineapple smell. It smells good, cabrón. <laughs> look how far through the concrete. Yeah, look, look at, this. at this thing here. Oh my God. Yeah, it's all gone. I mean, I don't know what else to tell you guys. The only thing that stays is the smell of pineapple. Yeah, the only thing left over is the smell of the pineapple. But there's, <laughs> where's the car? I don't know. I don't know. Let's, let's go see. Look. All the way back there, there's um, Yeah, all the way over there. Carol, there's no way we're gonna find this. Where? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Here. Cabron, here's the wheel. Something came down and hit my... Yeah, here's the wheel of that uh, RC car. There's that. And there's probably more pieces here somewhere. Here's some, here's pieces of that. <laughs> the axle of that RC car. Oh man. Oh, more pieces. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. That's how you take out enemies. <laughs> <laughs> With RC cars and some pineapple. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's it. Um, 
Hopefully the footage comes out uh, nice later because I know that first camera, the angle was really weird. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching. We'll see you guys next time.